Hey travelers, I'm here in the little ghost town of Silverville, Indiana. It's in Lawrence County, kind of in between Bedford and where the crane gate, like a mile down the road, there's a gate that cuts off the thing, so there's not much left of it. There's a few buildings and there's some common houses, but I was going to check out some of this old buildings. So check it out. This is the old store. If you see, there's the sil it says Silverville on it. But basically, I had a post office and the store and the church and some houses and this and that. It was a silver mill. It was named for silver, I guess. It was a little silver mine. And in the 40s, when they built the crane, the Navy bought all this land for crane and it basically blocks the road off. This used to go from Bedford all the way over to Martin County. On the 231. So, by building crane, it basically stuck a knife, a dagger into the, you know, into the wounded town of Silverville and killed it. Looks like an old house. Maybe somebody's fixing it up or. Bridges. There's a creek here, dry creek. This house is right on the creek. <laughs> Pug about ready to fall in. So this was the store. And I believe this was the delivery, you know, for like horses and back in the early 1900s. You got this area here, I'm sure there was structures in there. If I remember right, this would have been the post office back in the day. I'm not sure what this was. It is posted, so I'm not going to go up there. Probably not much to see. It looks like it's falling in. It's like some kind of a pump well over there. If I remember what I read, there was something on this side, right here on this corner as well. <coughs> yeah, there's a little church up the street here. I might go check it out and be heading back. I think this is really cool. Still got the Silverville name on it and all the moss all the vines are growing up it pretty cool neat old building this 
surprised it's still standing. Looks like it's been used in like 50 years. All right, I'm gonna drive up the road here and see the church. So I'm gonna pause it and I'll do a drive by on the church. There's another little house. fairly newer houses but this is the old church and cemetery coming up here first baptist silver church of silver 1891 to 1932 now it's a Silverville Missionary Baptist Church. It's not a complete ghost town, but it's just houses now. There's this, the sign for the end of Silverville. And then right up here, there's a, I believe it's the end of the road, crane, the gates up here. Off. It's one of those gates I don't really use a lot of time. They just use them for like trucks. And... There's another church in the cemetery over there. I think this road might go over here. Swing around right here. actually kind of cool there's a line that's set right here the blue line that says US government property so I guess I was trespassing on government property so. you know they don't really give you a lot of places to turn around so well I think that's it on Silverville so It's a little, little different type of video I don't usually do, but that was cool. I've always wanted to really come over here and check it out. So, if you guys see this video, you know, give it a like if you really like it. Subscribe, it's free. I love you forever. So, you guys have a good day. Stay safe. Peace out.